Okay, guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is another reading for Divine Feminine. So let's go ahead and get started. So the messages that was channeled for you guys were the numbers. The songs that came out was Disappear, um, Beyonce, and then um, Mother by Ashanti. And then the, the numbers that was channeled was 1137, 422, 409, 49, 103, 1130, 406, and then I got 604 too, um, 21, 201, and then the messages that was channeled was, didn't see the signs, and then um, wasn't ready, and then unconditional love, and then we have mother support. So these were the uh, channel messages that I had got so let's go ahead and get into the um, sp the spread so we have Anastasia okay we have less than four siblings and then we have don't worry comment is a bitch okay so I kind of feel like somebody that was evil okay tried to cause some type of um, harm okay to somebody here this could be somebody who was like an orphan okay you could have lost a parent here or both both parents or something like that here um, and you could have less than four siblings okay uh, but I kind of feel like somebody was trying to cause some type of evil or cause some type of harm towards you here and I kind of feel like there's no need to worry in this situation because the, these people is going to get that karma okay karma is a bitch in this situation you can live in the gated community as well because that also came out okay um so i kind of feel like you're trying to keep things stable and balanced in the situation here okay um i kind of feel like there was a fire sign here who wasn't telling the truth or who wasn't being honest in the situation okay somebody could have been lying or somebody could have been juggling um a juggling connection here or juggling you in a fire sign okay so somebody just wasn't telling the truth or being honest um i kind of feel like um as far as like the, the direction that you was moving in so i kind of feel like you know you was weighing out your options here, probably weighing your options out to see like which way you was going to move, which direction you was going to move into. And I kind of feel like you decided to move away from, you know, whoever this was that wasn't being honest or who wasn't being truthful to you in a situation. Okay. And I kind of feel like, um, because this person wasn't paying you no mind anyway, this is somebody that was toxic. Okay. With this devil card, um, card, they could have had a toxic connection to somebody else here. This person could have had addictions. Okay, um, and I kind of feel like you had blocked this person because it was too much of a burden to be connected in a relationship with this person or be in a relationship with them. Okay, they wasn't paying you no mind anyway, and he was lying to you a lot. And they could have been lying to you about a fire sign, um, okay, or a Capricorn. So, yeah, uh, or a Gemini. So, yeah, um, I kind of felt like, you know, you weighed out the pros and cons of this relationship or where you want to go in this relationship and you realize that somebody was just only giving you a little bit okay bread from you and it wasn't worth like those are no future you didn't really see no future with them or somebody wasn't like they wasn't like showing you that they wanted some type of future or something with you here okay um so yeah i just felt like you decided to move on away from them okay um in this situation because they wasn't giving no love they was hardly giving any love they wasn't giving no um, you know, they wasn't showing no emotions here. We had Page of Pentacles, um, back to back on top of the, um, King of Cups. So, yeah, I kind of feel like when somebody wants to communicate to you, they're really trying to communicate with you, but I kind of feel like, you know, um, you ended it with this person. So this person betrayed you. Um, you don't want anything to do with them at all. Um, because, you know, they toxic, you know, it's toxic. Um, so this is what I see here, dealing with this connection, yeah, so yeah, you could have moved away because the situation was burdensome, and I kind of feel like you went, you know, to find somebody who is more emotionally fulfilling for you here, okay, um, and I kind of feel like you put your boundaries up towards this person who was being toxic towards you, yeah, pretty much, you wasn't paying on no mind, this person was a liar, okay, um, and I kind of feel like karma is a bitch, so whatever they fucking did to you, they're going to end up getting that shit back tenfold, per your point blank, so we have hope, 
Okay, and it says Hebrews 6.19. So they want you to have hope in the situation here. We have make the effort. So it says great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So they want you to make some type of effort here. When it comes to a love connection, 7.12 can also be significant um, to you guys as well. But they want you to make um, some type of effort okay here when it comes to some type of love connection and they want you to actually have hope okay and faith in some type of connection or in uh, a certain situation here so um yeah so we have the house here the family so i kind of feel like your family is definitely going to grow here okay um i kind of feel like things is definitely going to be balanced out inside of your household here and i kind of feel like an opportunity is going to definitely arise for the family to grow and come back together here um we have this man with his chest out so i kind of feel like we have the ace of hearts so this person could have walked away this could have been this masculine here who you had walked away from here okay who was causing all um who was causing these burdens who was being toxic like i said they could have been um addicted to things they could have had a lot of addictions or they could have been tied to a comic person here but you ended up you know letting them go and going your separate way and they went their separate way you know you know what i'm saying but this person wants to communicate to you about this betrayal and they want to come back and make some type of offer they do love you here with this king of cups but they was only giving you a little bit you know bread from you and i kind of feel like you don't see like whatever they're giving you you don't see that you know going far but they telling you to like try to make the effort and have hope in the situation you know maybe this person is doing the bare minimum and this is what they can do i don't know but yeah so um we have the number 28 here so yeah i kind of feel like they want a relationship with you here but i kind of feel like they are emotionally distant right now so they're not really like wearing a halt on their sleeve but i kind of feel like they're going to come forward with this ace of cups okay and show you that this is what they want they want a family with you here and they want things to grow in this situation here with you they want the opportunity to you know make things right and work together here with you here with this um man with the chest in the birdhouse so then we have reflection and it says give each other some space at the moment it says trust and have faith that all will work out for the best so yeah this is the reflection period so this is the reason why you know you let them go that separate way or whatever the case may be you ain't paying them no mind none of that because you you letting them know like you need to reflect you know this is too toxic this is too much you know for somebody to handle if they really want to be with you then they will show you you know that they want to be with you in a proper manner Okay, um, so the other zodiac signs that we see, did I say all the signs? I said Aries, Leo, Sag, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Gemini. And I said um, a rising Aquarius, a Cancer rising, a Leo, Venus, Gemini, and Aquarius. So hopefully you guys got something from this. Go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, drop your comments, and I'll see you in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.